From ABC News, World Headquarters, this is ABC World News with David Muir. When we come back tonight, some real-life wonder twins, these brothers defying autism, and those Boston bombers, they are determined to finish their own marathon, and they are doing it tonight. Finally tonight here, the running of the New York City Marathon this Sunday. It comes, of course, after what happened in Boston earlier this year. And near the finish line, those 45,000 runners noticing a yellow line of inspiration to guide them in honor of the victims in Boston. And two of the runners today, twin brothers, wonder twins as we call them, both have autism and both have incredible determination, proving they are American strong. Here's ABC's Lindsay Janice. Today is 23-year-old identical twins Alex and Jamie Snyder's first New York City Marathon. It is 5.30 in the morning. So excited. First New York City Marathon. They are autistic and unable to communicate. For them, running is a form of therapy. This is our number one main activity as a family. Everything else kind of comes second to, to running. Alex, who's the fastest and runs with a coach, just set a new personal best. <laughs> 314 35. Yeah. Oh, Abby, you did it. You did it. <laughs> For Jamie, who runs with his dad Alan, the memory of the Boston Marathon has made today a struggle. There was a lot of crying and screaming and animated people around us, and he was traumatized. But Robin and Alan are determined to help Jamie get back to the races that have given him and his brother so much joy. They don't live a normal life, so right. this is something that really, I think, connects with them and mm -hmm. makes them happy. And just as we came to air, Jamie finished the New York Marathon. <laughs> Robin and Alan say the joy running brings to the entire family has been their greatest blessing. Lindsay Janice, ABC News, New York. We salute Alex and Jamie and all of those runners tonight. Good morning, America.